This video may contain graphic violence, strong languages, and material that may not be suitable for a younger audience. Parental discretion is strongly advised. Really? The fuck are you on my door? Hey, what are you doing? You chicken shit, talk to me like a fucking man. Charlie, Emma, what are you guys doing here? We locked ourselves into wait for you. Asshole, make you over there. No, of course not. By the way, I think Zach was spying on you guys. I caught him leaning up against the door, and he hurried back into his room the second I arrived. Creep. He was such a loser, and he well. seems to have a personal vendetta against you now after what you did to him. Claims you did last night. Gotta love the guy. So what's up? What's the occasion? We want to know what's going on oh. with you, April. What do you mean? Nothing's going on. That's a fucking bullshit. You're one of your best friends. That's way below you. We know something's going on. There's no point denying it. For three days straight, you've been away all day. You've been acting weird and hanging around Cortez, of all people. And then today we find out you've been up to Metro Circle by yourself? I mean, hey, for God's sake, what is going on? If I told you, you wouldn't fucking believe me. If I told you, you wouldn't believe me. Try us. We're your friends. Whatever it is, I'm sure we can help. Yeah, Somehow. Okay. Mm. I'm gonna tell the truth. I've been... Uh, chosen to save the world. You're gonna think I'm fucking <laughs> Stop bullshit. Stop kidding around, Abe. We're serious. So am I. I told you, you wouldn't believe me. You're actually telling us the truth. What do you mean you've been As chosen to save said. the world? As in, there's something really bad going down. I can't say exactly what, but Cortez is with the good guys, and I've been... Drafted. drafted. Look, April, if you're having some kind of nervous breakdown, we'll do anything to... God, I knew I should have kept my mouth shut. Forget it. I don't even believe in myself. So why should you? I believe you, April. I've seen things these past few days, strange, inexplicable things. And my grandma taught us that there's more to this world than Transformers. The and after all, it's you saying these things. My friend, April. I've never known you to lie or even exaggerate the truth. If you believe it, I believe it. And I'm sure the same goes for Emma. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Charlie. It means a lot to me. I wish I could tell you everything, but I don't think I can. I understand. When you're ready. But if there's anything, anything at all we can do to help, well, don't hesitate to ask. Thanks. Uh. There are a few things you can help me with. Great. What? Like I said, I can't really tell you very much about what's going on. Not yet, anyway. Tomorrow, after I've had a good night's sleep, I'll try explaining as much as possible. But there's one thing you can do for me. I have reason to suspect that somebody's out to get me, or Cortez. Who? Long story, but I could need some backup. These goons, these agents, they could be closing in, and whatever advanced warning you're able to give me... We'll do our best. What do they look like? I'm not sure. But you'll know when you see them, I'm sure. Anybody suspicious around, let me know. This is kind of exciting. But you gotta tell me, what are they after you no. for? Did you do something illegal? <laughs> not yeah, yet. Not really. It's what I might do that they're worried about. But please don't ask me any more questions today. Just keep your eyes and ears peeled for anything weird. I need a good night's sleep. And tomorrow I should be able to tell you more. But thanks for helping me out, guys. I really appreciate it. We're all hanging out at the cafe tomorrow night, April, so you're just gonna have to join us. I promise. Now get some sleep. Sorry to tell you this, but you look totally exhausted. I'm glad we had this talk. Thanks for checking up on me, guys. Sure. Good night. Good night, Charlie. Good night, girl.
Sweet dreams. Jesus. Oh no, poor Cortez. <laughs> Is that McAllen? Jacob McAllen? Oh look, there's a fucking portal in my room. Yay! What's that noise? How about no? How about no? Can I just nope out of here? I'm in my undies. Stop. Where's the light what? coming from? Are you trying to tell us something, April? Oh, oh. no. <laughs> Chapter four. is a dream I really do because if Cortez didn't open a shift who did good luck you opened the shift you did no dream and I'm guessing this is Mercuria it smells like it like a mix between fresh flowers and cow dung there's some kind of part going on in there what's the name <laughs> the journeyman. The longest the journeyman. journey. Very appropriate, though it really should have been the journey woman. Or you know, whatever who fucking cares. Filled with ale, probably. They never have beer in these taverns, just ale. I'd rather have mead. Assorted bottles, herbs, and spices. They're no, definitely you're, having You're fun. in your undergarment. It's their first date, I can tell. They're a cute couple. I wonder if romance is different here, can or can if I talk? Can I talk to the lady? Let Excuse me talk to the lady. Hello? Hi, hello, do you work here? Do I work here? Child, I'm the owner. I own and operate the Journeyman Inn. Sorry, ma'am. Your apology is more than enough for me, child. What may I do for you? Is there a party? <laughs> is there a party going on? Is there a... Ugh, child. Do you not know? It is the Feast of the Balance. Have you never taken part in the no. celebration? Unfortunately, no. I'm... Not a party person. Good. Answer. As long as I can recall, the feast has lasted three whole days and nights, and everyone celebrated openly. Now, this year, there is great concern about the vanguard and their supporters. Because the vanguards are dicks. <laughs> so this year, the feast of the balance is celebrated inside, behind closed doors, That's and for one night only. But there's still much food and drink. <laughs> And you are welcome to join if Yay. you so please. I don't think so. I don't know anybody here. You're not with the oh. vanguard, are you? Fuck <laughs> no. No, I'm from somewhere else. In the land far away. Far, far away. So seen. Well, if you feel up to it, child, you're welcome to Yay. join in the celebration. Thanks. Why do you celebrate the feast of the balance? You are a stranger to our customs, indeed. The balance. You do know about the kind balance, of? do you not? 
Sure. The balance between magic and science. I know about the balance. The balance of all, child. Everything is in balance. And the Guardian watches over the balance and us. We celebrate the Feast of the Balance to give our thanks to the Balance and to the Guardian. If our devotion to the Balance falters, if we lose our faith in the Guardian, then we are inviting chaos to destroy us. This is what the Vanguard is doing. Inviting chaos. They are dangerous. Perfect. What's the Vanguard doing to destroy the balance? They are not doing anything to destroy the balance, but they destroy people's faith dead. in the balance. They speak to the people, telling them how the Sentinel, the Fathers, are holding our world back. And that if we were to use the balance to our advantage, we could return to the old ways, the ways of the ancient Earth. But Before at the same the time, fight. there's a reason why that happened. Vanguard promised the people power, and wealth, and happiness. But they intend only destruction and death. What's your name? Finally asked her name. Benrima Salmon. I am the owner and proprietor of this inn. I bought it with money earned through honest trade in the Southlands. Tobacco, wine, slaves. Oh. That is where I'm from. Southlands. I'm April. Slave? April Ryan. Really? Are you? Well met, April Ryan. Have you come to meet someone, a handsome no. young suitor, <laughs> perchance? No such luck, I'm afraid. I'm here more by accident than anything else. Ah, <laughs> no accident, April. Fate. Fate delivered you here tonight. You are strong in fate, um, are you not? The fuck does that even mean? What do you mean by strong in fate? You shape your own fate, and not the other way around. You are what the dark people call a wave. How can you tell? I am not only an innkeeper child. I am a seer taught by my mother, who was taught by her mother before her. And so it goes back to the dawn of our world. To the dawn of magic. Really? Really? What a seer? What a seer? <laughs> What's a paladin? Fuck. Tabernak. Ask the fucking question, goddammit. What's a seer? <sighs> a seer? Ooh, is someone who can mm. tell something about people? Mm -hmm. About events? About the past and the present and the future? Just by looking at you. When I look God at you, it. I see... I see... Death. Dismemberment. What? Fucking what bullshit! Most people are drawn along by events. By fate. Like a carriage after a horse. But some people know how to steer I don't. the horse. To change paths at will. You eh? are such a person. Quay? But there is Excuse? more. Innkeeper by morning, see you in the night. Tell me more about my future. It is strange. I, I see many paths, but they are all dark. I cannot tell much except that you are strong in fate. And strong sure. in the balance. And you are strong eh? in magic, too. Magic? That can't be right. I'm not... I don't know anything about magic. magic. You do not have to know about uh, magic to be strong with magic. I kind of hit it a wee if bit with my hand. If you ever learn how to harvest your talents, you will be a strong artisan. What? Artisan? Where have you been schooled? An art child? school. Have you forgotten your lore? Art school, not a fucking my magic lore? school. <laughs> yeah, well, I haven't really had much use for my... Eh. Lore lately. The artisan is the most powerful of magic users. She is able to shape magic and to use it by force of will alone. 
An artist can use magic oh, shaped yeah. by others, molded into new magic. Ah. New art. Artisan. A magician. Or a sorcerer. Witch. Warlock. Can read and write incantations. Drawing spells from the power of words. And the alchemist can create magic potions. And he is an the alchemist. least of the four. Anyone with proper education can be an alchemist. The other three require some form of talent for magic. Thank you. I am at your service any time, child. I am afraid I must go take care of my guests now. Enjoy Boom. yourself. Um, the fuck it all. Thank you, eh? April Ryan. What? I'm sorry, what? There is no time here, but there soon will be time for you and I. Time enough to be sure. You are speaking to me, April Ryan. No, we no, we have fucking spoken. haven't. I don't understand what you're... And how do you know my name? Who are you? Have we not met yet? I was, I was sorry. Sorry then for confusing you. I will be Abnaxus of the Venar, ambassador to the Irid Council in Marcuria for eh? a time. I think I would have remembered you if we'd met. Who told you my name? You did. You are saying your name to me, April Ryan. In this moment, you tell me your name. You question why I know your name, and you speak to me the blessings of the balance for my long journey home. Huh? Sorry, I really don't know what you're talking about. It is difficult for us too, April Ryan, to understand you. We, the Venar, are not perceiving time like your people. In this moment, we are everywhere in this moment we are nowhere but there is a veil beyond this veil we are not seeing but you have you will be seeing you are eh? seeing what veil the veil created in chaos by chaos with chaos it is a dark presence in our future yes future, a dark veil which hides the things that have been and will be. What's all this got to do with me? It was late. You were tired. We have talked in the morning when you come to visit me. Now you understand everything. Thank you, April Ryan. The blessings of the balance to you too. Did you what? just invite me to your home? I will. I did. I invite you to my home, April Ryan. My home was in the Marcurius City in... Green, and you will find it in the morning before chaos came. I am explaining everything, and you understood. It seems I've already accepted your invitation, so I guess I don't have a choice. That is what you said. Good night. You will sleep True. well. Where the fuck am I sleeping there, bud? That looks like a really, Can really nap? comfortable chair. It's a very comfortable chair. Oh no, it's Woo! the comfy chair. <clears throat> so I really am getting tired. I should find somewhere comfortable to sit down. Oh, what about the comfy chair? Shit. Oh, and she sleep. And she's out. Um...
for Pez. Oh. Um. Cortez. Yeesh. Wake up, okay, child. Me awake. Sorry, I guess I fell asleep. Morn. What time is it? It is morning. We need to clean before we open for breakfast, so I had to wake you. I slept right through the party? It seems so. You did not stir even when That's everyone was sleep. leaving. Oh, well, I feel pretty good considering. You look a little pale, but it's nothing a good porridge won't fix. Not to sound rude, but I've had my fill of her for the moment. Can I leave? Do you intend to walk <laughs> about in that outfit, child? If it is day, it would not be proper. I'm but naked. Come. We will find something more suited to young ladies sure. about the city. Better? Clothed? Well, it'll have to do for now. You do not have oh the most God. womanly of forms, but I'm certain you will fill out in time. Of lots with the and right lots of diet. That. Thanks. Thank you for the clothes, for everything. You will have time aplenty to thank me while you're cleaning <laughs> plates and cutlery, child. I'm sorry. Work? Those clothes do not come free, child, nor does a knight spend sleeping before the fire. I'm not asking much, only for a Fair. helping hand in cleaning. All right. All right. Tell me where to start. You can start carrying in the mugs from the back room. I shall be fair. You did good work, child. More than was required. Here you are. Some coin to help you out. Woo! And keep the clothes. You seem to have grown into them already. Sure. Alright. Oh, yeah. It's a funny looking animal. Oh, well, this is funny, but it says furry. Doesn't look furry, though. Good beast. His hide feels like a turtle's, but softer. <laughs> yeah, good boy. Good boy. Why does it say a furry animal when it's not furry at all? That's that's false advertisement. Hardcore. Um Do I still have that I do? I should probably bring that delivery bill back. <laughs> to be honest. Hmm. How many days has it been since I delivered Brian? Hey, you! What's going on? Why didn't you deliver any maps yesterday? I'm sorry? I wasn't around. Sorry. Well, there are more maps to be delivered, and my customers are getting very impatient. Did you yes. deliver the map to the rolling man? Yes, sir. All right, let me see his signature, and I'll give you your next delivery. 
Uh, that? Yeah, it is it. Woo! Weren't you supposed to make yes. a delivery to the rolling man? Yes, yes I was. Then what in the deepest, darkest recesses of Mount Tierney are you doing here? Get to it and remember to get his signature. Oh, wife. Okay, fine. Fine. I'll go back to Brian. I'll, I'll go back to, I'll go back to Brian Hill. Millhouse? Hillhouse? Hmm. Either way. West House. West House. Hi, buddy. Can you... Can you... Say my thing? I should at least say hello Hi, before buddy. getting down to business. How you doing? I'm back. Hi there, Mr. Westhouse. I'm back. My word. <laughs> what on earth possessed you to return to this godforsaken place? You were lucky to escape the first time, but now you're really pushing it. It's not that bad a place, or else you wouldn't stay here. Besides, this time I didn't exactly come here by choice. And appeared. I stay here because I'm a true masochist, Miss Ryan. And who forced you to come? Was it Cortez? He doesn't even know I'm here, unfortunately. No, I think I had some kind of accident with my so-called powers. I shifted in my underwear. No, ha! <laughs> Isn't that the way it is, though? We always cross the rift at the most inopportune <laughs> times. <laughs> Care for a drink? Oh, no, no, that's right. You uh, don't. <laughs> Would you mind helping me with a few questions? I have nothing better to do, so shoot. Would you Probably be able not. to tell me where I could look for the entrance to the Guardian's realm? In Tobias's pants, <laughs> if he had his wish, I'm sure. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't know anything about the Guardians. Balance, or Sentinel, or gardening. <laughs> now, if bullfighting, I could talk all night. Bullfighting's a horrible act of cruelty yep. to animals, and not much of a sport True. at all. I'll just forget you said that, Miss Ryan. If there's one thing I miss about Stark, it's I feel like it's been outlawed. <laughs> You'll be happy to hear then that they abolished bullfighting Perfect. hundreds of years ago. <laughs> Do you know anything about uh, dragons? Yeah. I try to stay out of the affair of the kin these days. What precisely do you wish to know about the damn beasts? There are two dragons in Arcadia, and I'm trying to locate them. Yeah, I've heard that tale myself. But no, no, I don't know anything about it. You'd be better off speaking with the Sentinel Minstrum. After all, religion is their specialty, not mine. I'm looking for a disc that will open up the Guardian's realm. That's religion, Miss Ryan. <clears throat> and the only things I worship are whiskey, a good cigar, <laughs> and a nice long... <clears throat> no. Anyway, don't ask me about all that uh, <laughs> balance mumbo-jumbo. I can't think of any more questions for now. Then let's talk about other things, shall we? Mm. Thanks, Mr. Westhouse. Anytime, April. Come back if you're... I never get... did get it signed. A map of, uh... A map of, uh... The Wasteland. Trolling Man. Sign this, please. It's just to confirm that I made the delivery. Certainly. After a full fucking day? Finally gonna get it signed. <laughs> Let's go back to the map person. Here's the 
Here's your next delivery, a map of the Northlands to a ton Lyak, staying a journeyman in. And be quick about it. She's been waiting since the day before yesterday. Run, April, run! Cool, let's do! Dreamman's in. She's staying at the Dreamman's in. Excuse me? Yes? Oh! It is you! I'm looking for Tun Lyak. The sailor? She is looking for work today, I'm afraid. With most of the ships moored to the docks for balance knows how long, it is difficult for sailors to find work. Do you know when Tun Lyak is expected back? I could not tell you, child, but from what I know of the ships in harbor, she will not find one that needs a navigator any time soon. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome, child. Alright. I'm probably going to leave it here tonight. It's um, getting a little bit late where I am. And I'll just leave it here to meet... Uh, Fuck, I forgot his name. Hold on. Hold on. Who was the fucking last person I talked to? Ab Abnaxus? Naxus. Abnaxus. Oh, this guy. This guy. Alright. Let's get the game. This one. Yes. And... See you guys later. Bye.